Anglia institution for three decades. Now the rhythms and rituals of farm life are being brought to a 21st century audience. Walking 30 sheep down a road. The country equivalent to rush hour. It's a series that's got everything. <coughs> Drama. <coughs> hey Gran, it's Rufus, is mum in? No. OK, well, there's a sheep in the field. It's not looking its best. Joy. You clever girl. You clever girl. Even a bit of romance. I have an African goose called Crystal. <coughs> Don't laugh. And I've got her a husband called Edward. <coughs> <coughs> Crystal, are you going to look at Edward? Or have you gone all shy and coy? They just put a smile on my face, the silliest things. That's Edward and Crystal. The Den family are three episodes into their series, which follows Hedgerow Farm near Milton Keynes over the calendar year. Remember the cows? They've also had some babies. Twins, in fact. Son Rufus and his co-producer Josh are filming and editing, while Mum Sarah is the accidental star. You can't make it up. She's a fantastic woman. Uh, she's my mum, and she's hilarious. And I think we found we found a bit of a talent for for camera work too, which has been awesome. Don't kick me. I've asked you not to. You miserable cow. Sarah, though, is oblivious to the fact she's so entertaining. Her passion, to educate. I want people to, do, to know what I do on the farm, what happens, what I do with the sheep, what, what happens, you know, we have losses, we have births, we have all sorts of things going on. You know, I want those little children in those blocks of flats, and I want mums and dads, and, you know, all sorts of people to just think, oh my goodness, that's what you do, that's how they do it. And I love coming down here. It's lovely and quiet, and I can feed them, look after them, and love them, that's it. Well, we've been exhausted today just chasing after Sarah, although we're only, of course, filming all the hard work she's got to do. And true to character, while you've been watching that film, she's only gone and dashed off to start feeding, I think it's three lambs at the same time there. So I'll have a chat with her in a second. In the meantime, Rufus, it gives us a chance to speak to you. Yeah. And one of the things I love about the films is the fact that it's the relationship between you two, really, the fact that you yeah. are a little bit, let's say, squeamish, and your mum comes in, rolls up her sleeves, and delivers a lamb <laughs> you before breakfast. Yeah, admittedly squeamish. Um, I think kind of going away, uh, living, living away from the farm for 10 years now kind of has that effect. And so it's really, really nice to come back. It's really nice to spend time with mum and... Um, kind of understand a lot more about what goes on. Well, let's have a quick word of you could yeah. go and feed the lambs. In fact, I I might over. need to go up and. Should we? Should we yeah. bring you up and have a quick word with Sarah? Sarah, you've got a lot on there. Three lambs on the go. Uh, I can't How do you find time <laughs> to be a, a star of the screen as well? Oh, we can fit it all in, no problem. Nothing is too much. <laughs> You're enjoying it though. Yeah, we love it. We really, really like doing it. I think it's fantastic for young and old to see the animals and young baby ones and see what goes on on the farm. We've been well. seeing some of your stars. So yeah. we've got um, Crystal, the goose who's looking for love. We've got Eric the ram who's found quite a lot of love. And another chap who I'd just like to introduce you to, a very fine fellow, I'm sure you'd agree, a fine specimen. He's three years old, he's a beef shorthorn. And uh, his name is Jonathan. So I'll leave oh, you to how, that. how appropriate! <laughs> <laughs> I can see, the, oh, I can see the likeness in so lovely. many ways. He looks grumpy too. Thank oh, you, Claire and Sarah. Thank you very much. Happy.